Welcome back to my channel, Divine Timeless Cosmic Tarot. If this is your first time coming across my platform, welcome. This is going to be a general energy check by way of current events. New moon energy for water signs. Hi there, water signs. Come on in. If you're new to the platform, if you're cross-watching, hopefully you will decide to like, love, share, and or subscribe, or maybe you're just going to watch whatever you decide to do, I support you in the energy. But if you're returning back to this channel, you already know you are my water sign, cosmic cousins, sisters, brothers, aunties, uncles, friends, 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 brothers and sisters from another mother. You are my beautiful water sign, gang, 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 and I love you so much, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. The reading will be in that order. Come on in and let's just get to this spiritual work. Listen. Water signs. Water signs. Water sign gang, gang, gang. Gang, gang. Water sign gang, gang, gang. Why do I got to get so dramatic? It's just the way I am. I was born that way. You know, it's just the way it is. Water signs. Y'all should see my face. It's so dramatic. I promise you. All this drama I bring. Can we just have a real commercial break before we get started? I just feel like I can open up to my water signs, all these emotions, and share my feelings, and you all will be receptive. But like, honestly, y'all, I was born dramatic. I don't even want to lie. I was born dramatic. I don't know how to be anything else. And so I'm just glad that I'm at a point in my life well, I've always kind of not really cared. <laughs> so I'm not going to say all of a sudden I don't care what people think about me being dramatic. But it's got to be a vibe. You know, I just kind of feel it. Sometimes I'm in my kitchen and I might just be like, water signs. You know, and nobody's in there. It's just me. It just felt good to do. And so I'm doing it. And so, yeah, I don't know. This was some type of impromptu confessional. I don't know. Maybe somebody feels like they got to confess something to you, water signs. I just felt compelled to tell you all my business. It's a certain je ne sais quoi with my beautiful water signs. We're going to start out with cancer. Beautiful cancer. We're going to start you out at 255. Why not? I feel like that's a really good number. 255 for my Cancer gang, gang, gang. What's going on, Cancers? Holy Spirit, beautiful angels, universe, spirit team, ascended masters, and or spirit guides. Anybody trying to send me any nasty energy as I channel this pure white light. Listen to shit, light and or by way of confirmation. Oh, I just heard Cancer, you already know. You just here for shits and giggles. You just here maybe for a little bit of confirmation, possibly a little bit of, you know, spiritual comfort. And what it is that you already know. I just heard your spirit guides say, or my spirit guides tell me to tell you, Cancer gang, 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 you already know. What's going on? What is it that Cancer already knows? You already know. A Muslim is in somebody's energy. Somebody could be Muslim. Okay. Assalamu alaikum. Somebody could be saying something about their Muslim. It's upside down though. So somebody's a fake ass Muslim, <laughs> you already know. You like, okay, this is the kind of guy or girl or lady or whatever that, you know, they're like, oh, I'm Muslim, you know, and you catch them eating a ham sandwich. Muslim is in the reverse. It's like, what are you doing? Somebody's like, you know, the talented Mr. Ripley. This is somebody that's a chameleon. Yeah, Buddhist energy, okay. Buddhist energy, good energy. This is good grounded energy, though. Some of you could be spiritual teachers. Somebody could be a doula, okay? Or this is your calling. I'm getting divine feminine energy and masculine energy. Something about being a teacher, helping people transmute energy is what I just heard. But somebody's a fake Muslim. Buddhist energy, I feel like you're in a Zen state of mind, Cancerian. You might need to watch the Leo reading if your birthday's in July. Yeah, you got some weird ass people coming up against you is what it is. 
So people could be kind of mocking your spirituality, like, oh, what are you into now? Like, yeah, type of an energy. This is just for people to check you and see if you're serious about what it is you're doing. I feel like whatever it is, it works for you. Thank you, spirit. I just heard meditation and concentration. Yeah, you are really grounded. This is a really nice energy. Open up the door. Give us more of this energy universe. Something about that Lionsgate, something about that retrograde and that last full moon. Ooh, I think you made a decision to drop something off indefinitely. And it could have just been feelings and or emotions that you just don't need no more. But there's a fake ass Muslim. Somebody's faking it to make it. Whatever you're into, they're into, right? It's like, oh, well, what do you like to do? Oh, whatever you like. You're like, no, your own personality. Like, who are you? They're like, whatever you like. You're like, nah. Uh -huh. It's a turn off. You know, you gotta feel a vibe. It's a vibe for you. Yeah. I just heard catch that wave. That could be significant. I don't know. Somebody could be going to the beach or by the water. Catch that wave. Or somebody's like a bandwagon jumper. Who's this fake Muslim? Who's this person in the reverse? Child, somebody that is just weird. I don't know if this is a friend of yours. Okay, whatever this is. Three of Cups, you're celebrating. You're meeting new people or you will be. Page of Cups energy, somebody's very immature. This could be like immature in their spirituality. Spirit is like, you already know. This is just confirmation. Maybe they're trying to find themselves, their spirituality, who they wanna be. And somebody's just kinda having some type of an identity crisis. But something about you standing in your power with Buddhist energy, you're in this namaste, zen energy, breathing, grounded, you know, you know when to go within, you know when to get away from people is what I'm getting. It's like, yeah, I just heard crabs in a barrel. Okay, so you could have some people that want to hold you back, pun intended, by way of crab. You're very, very cautious. You're listening to your intuition. You're not moving so quick. Mm -hmm. I don't know who that is. But somebody's coming up against you. This could be based on your spirituality. This could be sexism. Uh, I don't know. Social class, spiritual. I'm getting spirituality. What it is that you're into. It's like somebody wants to debate. Somebody could be dealing with a Libra or an Aquarius. A February Aquarius child or an October Libra. That's not, that's not for everybody. But that's what I feel. Somebody could be debating with you. Like about Jesus, Christ, what you believe, something. I don't know. Somebody just, I don't know. They feel like you got to conform. Yeah, page of wands. This is about information. Somebody could be getting information on something, studying something. Show me Cancer's energy, current energy. Please and thank you. I feel like you're in a good energy. I do. You're making good investments. You're watching where you put your energy, your money, your time. Let's get to the get through. Cancer, gang, gang, gang. Cancerian, gang, 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 doing your thing, thing, thing. I just heard your energy is out there thanging. That thing is thanging. It's really good. Seven of Pentacles, clarify for Cancer. What's going on, Spirit? Yeah, somebody wants to come in. I don't know who this little weird ass, immature ass friend is. They're like immature in their spirituality. They don't know who they are. It's like they're trying to learn. They're trying to figure it out. I feel like your patience has run out with this person or you're just being a good example, standing in your power and what it is that you believe in. It's like, I don't see you really attaching yourself to one way of being. You're just studying, you're learning. But something about meditation, okay, is doing your body good, your mind some good. Nine of Pentacles, who is this person? You're in this King of Cups energy. You're showing a lot of love, Cancer. Self-love, self-care, okay? Somebody could need a spa day. Okay, come through with the come through. Who's this Knight of Pentacles? Somebody wants to come in and make an offer, but they're like faking it to make it. Two of Wands, Aries energy. Who is this person? Somebody's birthday could be in April, okay? There's like a decision that they need to make. Clarify this person, who is this person? Somebody kind of looks down on somebody, though, like a control freak, you know, type of an energy. Somebody could be a Gemini in May, too. There's a lot of page and night energy. 
You could just see this person as somebody that's childish, or this could be somebody's child, okay? Take it as it resonates. The magician, what are you manifesting? Something about good news, about money. Who is this person coming against cancer? Yeah, it's like some type of communication. Somebody wants to challenge you. They want to argue. They want to debate politics and religion and spirituality and what's going on yeah and meanwhile you're just minding your business ace of pentacles you got a new beginning somebody could be pregnant something about unexpected income this could be child support too with this page of pentacles and this ace of pentacles what's going on for cancer yeah somebody want to argue who is this five of swords who is this i just feel like you're protecting your energy and you're not available for it yeah you're following your intuition you see this person coming a mile away. Somebody's all over the place. They got Muslim in the reverse. Who is the Muslim in the reverse? Somebody's just combative. This could be somebody in your family. Okay, Ten of Cups. A family member that's like watching you. Okay, they got something to say. A cousin, a brother, an auntie, sister, mama, daddy. Somebody is like, oh, well, what are you doing now? Or this is not how you're supposed to do it. Somebody's mother could be a Taurus. Okay, Three of Swords. This is heartbreaking for you. This, 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 this is like divide and conquer you know what i mean if i have to divide myself and separate myself from you in order to conquer this invisible beef with you having issues about who i am then so shall it be you're walking away you could have really isolated yourself gone into hermit and just separated yourself give me current energy on this for, for yeah you ain't got time who is this five of wands still silent competition jealousy the more you become aware you know that you're aware of who these people are around you and how they are just not conducive to this next level for you. You're just walking away. Somebody could be looking at you like, oh, you think you're too good. You're like, yeah, I am. I'm too good for this. This is bullshit. This, this right here is not healthy. You know, five of wands, what is that, jealousy? Who's this fake Muslim? Show us this fake Muslim. Queen of Pentacles, the Taurus Virgo Capricorn. I don't know. I feel like, I don't know who this is. This could be a mother figure. Clarify this fake Muslim. Muslim in the reverse. Knight of Wands energy. Somebody could be a Capricorn, Virgo. <sighs> Taurus. Mm-hmm. Or somebody a Sagittarius, Aries, or a Leo. Or somebody's birthday. Let me just break it down. Somebody's birthday could be in April. Somebody's birthday could be in December. And somebody's birthday could be in August. Who is this person? Standing solid on their beliefs, okay? This could be somebody's child's mother if you're a masculine. Who is it? Who is this Queen of Pentacles Muslim in the reverse? Or somebody's trying to decide. It's like they're all over the place. If this person was in some type of Muslim practices or the Nation of Islam or 5% Nation or you know, Sunni, Muslim, whatever, whatever they're deciding to study. This person's at a crossroads. They're confused. They don't have an identity. And it's almost like they're mad because you do. Even if they're not voicing this intuitively, you can feel this. Show me this person. Who is this person? Queen of Wands, Aries Leo Sagittarius. Yeah, this place is an Aries Leo Sagittarius. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm getting April, December, or August is a birthday for somebody. Clarify who this person is. Yeah, they're in their head. Like, they got, their, when I say they have some type of identity crisis, they're all over the place. And the fact that, again, that you're standing in your authenticity really does shake this person up. It really does ruffle their feathers. I get this irritation. You know, it's something about walking in your truth that really irritates somebody. And you got this King of Cups energy. So it's almost like you can feel your authenticity. You're speaking your truth. When you don't have anything good to say, you don't say anything. If you don't feel like being around somebody, you know when to shut it down. You're in a temperance energy. You know when to balance something out. Ace of Pentacles, you could have some type of unexpected income coming in or something like this. Something that you're getting that's coming in really beautifully for you. Okay, but whatever this conflict is with the family or somebody that you had a family with, you're not with the shits. This person already feels defeated by you because you're in this Zen energy, Buddhist energy. Clarify what's going on, Holy Spirit. 
somebody feels like women shouldn't do certain things. Like somebody's very, uh, what am I thinking? Divine feminine. They feel emasculated by your femininity, by your security and your femininity. Okay. Mm -hmm. Somebody's very uh, chauvinistic. Thank you. Three of Pentacles, Capricorn energy. Clarify. Yeah, this person could be looking down on you based on your color, your age, your sex, your gender. Yeah, big Capricorn energy. Somebody puts a lot of time and thought into you. Okay. Show me, show me cancer though. Don't show me no more of these people. Yeah, you're happy. You ain't got time. <laughs> I don't know what the hell somebody got going on. Big July Cancerian energy. You could have Leo highly aspected, hence the fact that you're in the month of July. However, this does not negate the fact that you are a June Gemini. Oh, why did I say June Gemini? You could be a Gemini Cancer. Somebody could be like on June 21st or 22nd. <laughs> Clarify the magician. Yeah, there you go. Here you go, right here. The Wheel of Fortune, Gemini. Even though you are a watcher sign, you're giving out a lot of Gemini energy. Maybe watch that Gemini video. I feel like it will absolutely resonate with you. And for my July Cancers, watch that Leo video. I feel like it's going to resonate with you. You got good energy though. The sun and the will of fortune. Yeah, you like, mm -mm, I'm not letting anything stop me. I feel like these people feel like you're supposed to be emotionally available to them because it's like, we're family. No, they're immature. Yeah, look, divine intervention. You know who you are. Ace of Wands. You could be changing your diet, okay? Somebody could be making like smoothies and eating better and yeah, I can't make this up. You're focused on your higher self, the higher font. The higher font is somebody that's a spiritual teacher, leader, okay? Somebody that is talking to their ancestors, seeking higher guidance, not this BS, whatever. Somebody want to fight. you like, ooh, what a waste of energy. Like, that's such a waste of energy. Whatever somebody got going on, clarify. You ain't got time for that. You got a lot of good energy. I cannot make this up. Four of Wands, yeah, that Leo reading is absolutely going to resonate with you. It absolutely will. Listen, Four of Wands represents a beautiful divine partnership, weddings, celebrations, self-love, and somebody's in their head about who they want to be, and they're angry because you know who you are. And I feel like you are really emotionally detached for healthy reasons. I just heard healthy boundaries keeps you alive longer. <laughs> we need to put that on the t-shirt. Yeah, look. King of Wands energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You got a partnership here. Something's very, very, uh, yeah, I cannot make this up. I cannot make this up. There's a Virgo in your energy or a Leo. Okay, somebody's birthday's in August. Clarify this nine of pentacles. There is slow moving energy. Yeah, mm-mm. You, you, uh, uh, uh. uh, -uh. uh, -uh. You're like, nah, I'm good. Two of cups in the reverse, okay? Take these readings as they resonate. I'm picking up on a whole bunch of stories, but the two of cups in the reverse, this could have been a friend. Somebody think they're going to slowly move themselves right on back in, wiggle their way back in. Maybe that's that Knight of Wands energy and no sabe. Whatever it is, somebody's in their head. Somebody's a fake-ass Muslim. They don't know who they are. Two of cups in the reverse, they don't know which way they're going. This is like not a good investment. You could already see it as something that's like, no, nah, I'm good. Two of Cups, you're turning down somebody's offers. Uh, Nine of Pentacles is the slowest moving energy, okay? With somebody thinking that they're going to be lackadaisical by way of their pursuing you, but I don't feel like you're holding your breath. Child, hell no. Yeah, mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. This person is losing it. They're meditating, contemplating how can they come in, how can they come in to make some type of offer to you. Nine of Wands is Sagittarius energy. Child, it's a hell to the no. So a Virgo could be significant or a Leo could be significant or a Sagittarius could be significant or somebody's got fire and earth in their chart. There's also a September Virgo Libra here as well that could also be significant, okay? Or people have this or somebody has this highly aspected. Whatever the circumstance, I feel like you're just in this really good energy. Something's good coming in by way of a partnership. This could have already happened. Yeah, somebody is way down. This is an ex-lover. I don't know who the hell this is, but somebody is really way down. I just heard somebody that took you for granted. Ten of Wands is Sagittarius energy. The lover's in the reverse. Uh, yeah. Mm-mm. 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 
I just heard you didn't show no love or somebody didn't show any love or they took for granted. Clarify this. Why is this important? Because they're watching you. They don't want anybody loving you. You're in a knight's energy. This person's emotionally manipulative. Mm -hmm. This is about winning for them. Yeah, they're obsessed with you too. They got some addictions. Somebody got addictions. You hear me? They could be addicted to sex. Ooh, I just heard drugs and alcohol. Okay, but they hide it. They hide it. They see you as the end all be all. You're coming up as the moon and the empress. But with the moon and the devil, this person is very sexually, I just heard a sexual deviant. This person wants to dominate you. Be this a feminine or a masculine. Take it as it resonates. But yeah, they're like a sexual deviant. This is an energy vampire. Somebody that comes along and after you leave them, you know, you're just like, oh, I'm tired. You know, I uh, just, I don't want to do anything. Yeah, they're draining energetically, not just sexually. Do they try to drain your energy? But they try to do it with conflict or mind games or keeping you in your head. And now it's a wrap. This is how this person sees you. They're hiding their feelings, but they're obsessed with you. Meanwhile, child, you got the whole ten of pentacles here. Ain't nobody got time. L l listen here. Come on in here, Cancerian. Let's have a talk. Cancer gang, gang, gang. Ten of pentacles. Listen, you got you got the bag coming in. Yeah. You leaving somebody's ass out in the cold. Five of pentacles. It's a no. It's a solid no. Clarify. You're meditating. You're in a zen state of mind. Show me cancer. Yeah. You ain't got time. Listen. You are standing your ground along with your ancestors. You got divine intervention. And there's just a block that you're not going to spin again. And somebody's ass didn't get the memo that that was the last time they were going to be able to spin the block with you, have a conversation, be in your energy. Somebody didn't know the last time was the last time. Somebody was taking that, you know, that, that ability to have that open door, you know, uh, the ability to have an open door policy I just heard to contact you, communicate with you. They thought that was a joke. They thought, oh, okay, you gonna always be here. Uh-uh, uh-uh. You standing your ground, seven of wands, big July cancer energy coming through, okay? June cancer energy, I mean, overall energy for cancer and energy, listen, it's the 10 of pentacles, whatever you working on, and partnership. You got a beautiful partnership. I told you you're in this temperance energy. Temperance is about balance, pulling back, you know, self-love, self-care, really listening to your instinct and getting away from whoever these family members are. Like these people don't get no pass with they bitter ass. Somebody want to fight, tell you what to do. Yeah, you ain't playing the world. You're closing out cycles. You ain't spending no blocks. You're closing out cycles. And that's just what it is. And whoever doesn't understand that, that's just not your problem. That's just... Child, don't play with me. I will sing a song in a minute. That's just not my problem. That's just... Listen, I don't give a damn who know who say what. That's not your problem. And somebody don't like it. I just heard emotionally dependent on you. 4.55 on the clock. Somebody didn't see them changes coming. 5.55 five, five, changes coming. That is Oshun's number. Something about money coming. So money's coming in for you and somebody got five of wands, five of swords, five of pentacles coming in for them. And source guided you to close out this cycle. Listen, <laughs> I just heard your skin is looking good. Come through with the come through then. Yeah, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. You see things differently. This was kind of like this. So somebody could be trying to manipulate your view of something. Maybe they don't want you to see them for who they are. But listen, you already know. It's like somebody looking you right in your face and they're just lying. And you're like, uh-huh. And in the back of your mind, you're like, this one for lying. They like it. You're like, oh, yeah. Oh, that's what happened. So what did you say? And they just align their ass off. That's what I see. Child, somebody don't know who they are. And the fact that you do is making them very uncomfortable. Yeah, I can't make it up. Queen of Cups, you ain't got time. You're coming up in self-love. Listen, Queen of Cups is psychic. She's intuitive. He's intuitive. You got the Queen of Cups, King of Cups. You got a partnership coming in. You could be going into a partnership with another water sign. Mm-hmm. Child, that would not, let's have a moment of silence for that. That would be deep. That would really be deep. Two water signs. Can we just, can we just take a, a, I have to straighten out the camera on that one, Cancer. Verify this Queen of Cups and King of Cups. What's going on with him? I don't 
don't know. Whatever it is, you're moving forward. You're coming up as yourself as the chariot. <laughs> Cancer's like, yes, this is Cancer. And you're moving forward. Something about your willpower. Yeah, your ancestors are blessing you. Everything that you want is coming in. Something's real significant about December. I don't know what, what December is, but I feel like blessings are about to just start rolling in. Okay, I just heard December. What's going on? Somebody, yes, yeah, Spirit says, what I'm saying is the truth, child. I ain't got no time for lies. Listen, we ain't got time. Why lie? Well, you can just keep it real. Keep it a bug. Keep it a thou wow. Ace of Swords. Spirit says, what I'm saying is the truth. You're moving forward. This is beautiful energy, child, while somebody else is not. Who is this out here gossiping? Knight of Swords in the reverse. Who is this out here gossiping? Somebody is trying to energetically attack you and the shit ain't reaching you. Why? Because you're in bliss. Your blissful energy is combating this nasty energy without you even having to bat an eye, without you even having to give this any type of attention in any way, shape, or form. Whoever thought they was about to knock you off this good energy, who is this Knight of Swords in the reverse? Could be an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Child, who is this? Who is this? Why? Who is this Knight of Swords in the reverse spirit? Child, somebody you left out in the five. <laughs> in the five of pentacles child somebody you left out in the cold somebody that's mad they sad they going through it but they don't understand the energy they put out is why their life is in shambles not a source in the reverse child that is a nasty time somebody talking running their mouth gossiping well i heard cancer said well they said cancer said well did you hear about cancer and child they in the whole five of, did i not just say changes was coming five 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 of swords five of wands five of pentacles all the fives are here yeah it's a wrap meanwhile you got an offer coming in this is this is like somebody that's stable king of pentacles is grounded i feel like you're all the queens Whoever this cancer, uh, cancer masculine is, divine masculine, he's all the kings. Big divine feminine energy, though, is representing here. Somebody is very, yeah, Ace of Cups, what is this? You got good business. Come through with the come through. Something that you do for work. Eight of Pentacles is about to pay off, child, and get you to ten of Pentacles because you're in alignment. You're minding your own business. You're staying away from people that make you feel a certain way because you're saying, I'd rather be by myself. You came up out of something with these family members. Who are these raggedy family members? you like, I love y'all. I do. I just don't like y'all. And that's okay. I don't like y'all. I don't want to be around y'all. I limit my time. Somebody's limiting their time. Yeah, look. You, you are so tapped in. High priestess. You know. you like, nah, I'm good. That's why as soon as I pulled the card, the first card... I heard spirits say, Cancer, you already know. <laughs> you just came here to see a little bit more about what it is you already know. You already know this. I don't feel like I'm telling you anything that you don't know. Yeah, I cannot make it up. Did I not just say the Ten of Pentacles? What do they think you're doing out here playing around? So while they pussyfooting around in the Five of Pentacles, Five of Wands, Five of Swords, looking for whom they can devour, Nine of Swords in the reverse is gossip, slander, rumors, evil eye you know trying to attack you that shit is bouncing off of you and just returning the sender because you're minding your business yeah in order to get this ten of pentacles you can't be sitting on your hands you're minding your business and something that you're doing for work is paying off somebody's a spiritual teacher leader psychic buddhist energy if not this is what you're going into Zen energy, teaching people how to heal, uh, energy healing, something like that. Okay, I'm getting doula, women, babies, something, healing, something is beautiful. Yeah, somebody could already have their own, or somebody wants to do something with crystals and candles. Yeah, this is like somebody makes jewelry. Thank you, spirit. If not, you've been thinking about it. This is going to be real lucrative. Yeah, you're focused. I feel like when you keep yourself busy, yeah, you've been thinking about this. Look, Spirit says yes. High Priestess Energy. 
intuitively your ancestors are talking to you, giving you the next like game plan. And I feel like when you mind your business, you don't have time for this. Let them talk. I feel like at some point, maybe this was a little hurtful, but where they messed up is they got you in a position. They didn't get you nowhere. Let me recant my statement. I digress. You got yourself in a position where you don't give a fudge. You ain't got no more dams to give, no more fudges to give, okay? Listen, anything else we need to know for cancer? It's all looking good, though. Yeah, these are people from the past. You could be feeling a little nostalgic. You could be thinking about people, okay? Something about memories. Yeah, but it's, that's just all that it is. That's as far as it goes, right? Six of Cups. Or people from your past just still trying to come up. Yeah, they feel like you owe them something. Who are these people? Somebody feels entitled to what it is that you're working on. They feel entitled to your time. They feel entitled. Somebody needs to like get this cooking thing off the ground. What is this? Somebody wants to start something with cooking. Maybe on YouTube, TikTok, or something about your meals, a cookbook. Something like that. Somebody could do pastries. Child, I got a whole bunch of creativity here. Who am I talking to? Cancer gang, gang, gang. It's a yes, yes, yes. The universe says yes. Your ancestors are pushing me. Yes, do it. This is all going to work out. Money is coming in. Something is really beautiful. And you got a beautiful union. Whatever this union is, somebody's very supportive. Like, it's safe. It's like, I feel safe with this person, right? But Six of Pentacles in the reverse, child, who are these people? In the Five of Pentacles begging, Six of Pentacles in the reverse, people from your past. So you could have people that want to spin the block, okay? Maybe that's why December is significant, you know, holiday season. Well, it's holiday season, you know. I know last year I messed up Christmas, like that type of an energy. I'm like, what? This is what I'm getting, you know, come back around. These are family members. They're manipulative. They want something from you. People are used to you giving, okay? At least to certain people. Somebody in the family. They want you to give. But if the Six of Pentacles is in the reverse, your spirit team is saying it's a hell to the no. And I don't think you give a damn anymore. Five of Cups in the reverse. <laughs> you don't care. You're just like, nah, I'm good. Yeah, that ain't gonna work this time. Five of Cups in the reverse. My nose is itching. Spirit says, what I'm saying is the truth. I ain't got no more dams to give, no more fudges to give. Y'all crazy and y'all sneaky. You little sneaky little bastards. Somebody could get somebody in the family to call you, invite you to something. I'm getting like a family gathering. Somebody's mother's birthday is in December. December 19th or December 9th or something like that. Okay, well, that's fine. Somebody sneaky and deceptive, child. Yeah, somebody's going to be trying to get you to come out. Spirit is saying no. Uh-uh. Decline gracefully. Oh, no, I have something already on my itinerary. Or if you decide not to dignify these people with a response and or an RSVP, the universe is backing you. Okay. <laughs> it's an absolutely fantastic energy. Yeah, these people are crazy. Ten of Swords. What the hell? These are people that betrayed you. They talking about you. And now that you're in this winning energy, yeah, you got a new beginning and your cup is overflowing. They want a part of it. They want to be a part of it. They want to be in the winning, you know, energy. It's a no. Uh, yeah, you got an emperor coming in, child. You healing. Look at this. This is beautiful. Yeah, somebody's sneaky and deceptive. You're taking a leap of faith. You're going to win. You're going within. You could be holding on to your money right now. You got marriage coming in here, too. This is a high-level commitment. Something about your work. Eight of Pentacles. <laughs> Clarify cancer's work. What's going on? Yeah, you could have to travel. Three of Wands, okay? Three of Wands also represents foresight, something about a vision board. Mm-hmm, you could see this. Three of Wands, something about you having to travel. Clarify for work? Yeah. Let me tell you something. Somebody's ass is going to jail. I don't know who this is. This came out of nowhere. Somebody's ass is going to jail. So I don't know who this person is to you, what they got going on. Could be this air sign. Could be a Libra. Could be a Libra. Mm-hmm. Eight of Swords, y'all, they going to jail. This is so clear. Eight of Swords to the uh to the uh justice. Could be a Libra. Or just an air sign. But Libra's coming up real heavy. I think this is this Knight of Swords. Yeah, in the reverse. Who is this person? Damn, yes, it's an air sign for sure. 
Queen of Swords is at the bottom of the deck. What the hell going on here? Yeah, somebody was paying some type of an illusions. Seven of Cups. They feel like a fool, child. Now they're about to take a leap of faith into that jail cell judgment. Who is this? Ooh, why you get a new beginning, child? Mm-mm-mm. Sometimes life ain't fair, but in this particular case, you are getting exactly what you deserve, which is the Ten of Pentacles, the Wheel of Fortune, the Ace of Wands, King of Cups to the Queen of Cups, the Emperor is here, the Empress. Like, this is beautiful. I saw the Emperor in here. Okay, so listen. Of course it's going to jail, spirit. Yeah, I told you. Somebody that was trying to paint some type of illusions. I just heard falsifying something, tricking the justice system. Whoever this is, they going to jail. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Yeah, spirit is saying, continue to hold your energy. Pull back from these people. It's a win for you. King of Pentacles, your money is about to be looking real good. Hell yeah, you ain't got time. King of Swords on their ass. Anything else we need to see? Yeah, walk away. Uh-uh. Listen, this is your divine spirit team, the Hierophant. This is you and your higher level self. This is you sitting with yourself, meditating, listening to your intuition, not ignoring your hunches, your intuition, and sitting with your spirit team. You ain't got time. Keep walking. Leave these people out in the cold, honey. Eight of Cups to the Five of Pentacles, child, these people betrayed you so much. A lot of what they did hasn't even come out yet. But intuitively, you're the high priestess. You can feel it. You don't need to know the details. You don't need to know the details. No, nah, you don't. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Hell no. Mm-mm. You know exactly what these people did. You just know it was something that wasn't right. With the lovers in the reverse, you got an obsessed lover. This person's going to continue. Um, they're a narcissist, okay? They got addiction, sex addiction. Somebody could be addicted to porn, addicted to watching you. Like, this person is, whatever the lesson was, it's already, it's already something that you learned, okay? So whoever they are, it's a no. Mm-mm, mm-mm. They need to go on back to wherever they came from, wherever that is. But I just get this feeling of somebody, like, itching to spin the block. They could be waiting on a certain date. They could have been waiting on your birthday. Somebody could have contacted you around your birthday, July or June. Or they're waiting for the holidays. Like, hey, how you doing? Like that. You know, I was just thinking about you. But somebody's plotting on how to come back. Type of an energy. Whoever the fake Muslim is, it's a no, honey. Okay? But somebody's looking down at you based on your spirituality. But you're happy. You're happy. You're looking at them like, if y'all so happy, why are you so worried about me and what it is I got going on? 37, 37, child. I cannot make it up. Ooh, Cancer. That is your reading. Holy Spirit, beautiful angels. Close that door. That was a lot. Ooh. I call my energy back from that. Lord, have mercy. Who are we doing next? I was going to do Scorpio next, but I'm going to do Pisces. Pisces, we're going to start you out at 37.55. Hi, Pisces. Why isn't my pen working, Pisces? Pisces, what's up with my pen? Jeez. Okay, 37.55 for Pisces. Pisces, gang, gang, gang. Where I was going with that note? <laughs> That's so nasally. Pisces, gay, gay, gay. You're doing your thing. Somebody's birthday is March 9th. Okay, hey, Pisces. March 10th, March 17th. Come through with the come through. March 2nd. Something about a lease agreement, okay? Something about a lease agreement. This came out, I think, in Aries reading. Watch your documentation. Watch what it is that you're signing between now and the end of the year. If you're going into like a new place, documentation, something about conversation and documentation. You are a March Pisces. You might need to watch that Aries reading. I think it came out for fire signs, but something about a signature agreement. I just heard binding contracts. So be very, very mindful. This could be for an apartment, a place to live, or a vehicle, or maybe both. The spirit is saying to watch something. There's some type of there's some type of clause or something in the contract you need to be mindful of. 
Clarify uh, for Pisces, current energy, beautiful universe, group efforts, gang moves. Oh, shit. What's going on, Pisces? What in the... That's how I feel. You know what I'm saying? What do they mean? Group efforts, gang moves. What is that about? What is somebody... Somebody's a bully. Somebody's an energetic bully. Okay. I just heard Virgo, Libra, Aquarius. Okay. Whoever these people are. In a Taurus. Who are these people? Why is that there? Lisa Green. Yeah, somebody's like trying to gang up on you and sexual connection. Child, what is going on? Yeah, it's a court case out here. Okay, so this could be involving child support, domestic violence, attacks, civil matters, crime, fraud, theft. What the hell is going on? Yeah, something about documentation, somebody's signature. And then, I mean, as if things were not odd enough by way of this energy, there's some type of sexual connection. Okay, we're going to get to it. All these cards, you are the only sign that all these cards came out for. <laughs> Everybody else has been one card or two cards. Well, water signs, if, if they, I think, was it that like that for fire sign? It might have been. I don't know. I can't quite remember, but... Child, what is going on? My earbuds keep coming out. What is going on? Let's have a conversation. A court case. Holy Spirit, beautiful angels. Protect me as a channel of the highest of white lights for Pisces. Pisces, you got a gut feeling about something. Something's got you uneasy. You could be having like stomach feelings. Somebody from your past. Six of Cups. The Six of Cups represents nostalgia. Somebody from the past. Is this the sexual connection? <laughs> like, why? Why? Why am I getting this feeling to my stomach? Yeah. What is going on? You intuitively notice something's up. You like something is going on. I just don't know what it is. Clarify group efforts, gang, gang, energy, court case, lead, sexual connection. Yeah, something about you moving forward. The chariot. Somebody could get some type of parking violation or traffic stop. Okay, type of violation. So be careful. Spirit is saying like that need for speed. Mashing the gas. I just heard somebody is like. <laughs> Pedal to the metal, okay? Or metal to the pedal? Which way does it go? Yeah, what's going on? Some type of information is coming in. This could be by mail. Clarify. Six of cups in the bone. Not a bone. Chuck, come on out with the comfort. What, what is going on? Okay, listen. Somebody from the past is coming back. They want to spend the block, okay? This person could also be passing by your house or where you live or where you work, wondering where you're at. Nine of Wands energy is Sagittarius energy. Nine of Swords is Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Big Gemini energy, the lovers, okay? This is a past lover. Somebody wants to apologize. Page of Cups, okay? Clarify this person, what's going on? Yeah. Ace of Pentacles, something about a big payout. I don't know if this has something to do with the court case, child support, or something. This could have something to do with uh, a child. What am I hearing? Somebody's trying to make sure you don't get something. It's a group effort. Who is this person? Yeah, and they're in their head about it because they can't stop it. It's coming to you. Who the hell are these people? Group effort. Why am I hearing that? It's a payout. It's a lump sum of money. This could be back old child support. Yeah, somebody feels defeated. Five of Swords in the reverse. Somebody has no case or something. Yeah, somebody, somebody feels defeated. They feel like they don't want to fight anymore. They're in their head about something they can't stop you from getting. Clarify what's going on, Holy Spirit. What's going on with this? Yeah, what's going on? This is over. Somebody could be dealing with a Scorpio. Kick your cups at the bottom of the deck. Scorpio Pisces Cancer. Mm, some type of correspondence is coming in. This could be somebody in November. November Scorpio is what I just heard. Yeah. Mm, this is deep. Somebody's dealing with a Gemini. There's some type of communication coming in. What's the game moves, the group efforts? Somebody could ask you to co-sign. That's not for everybody. A son? Somebody could be a Pisces mother and your son could ask you to co-sign. Maybe that's what that agreement is. 
So Spirit is saying to be mindful of what you sign your name to, what you agree to. Legally binding contract. Be mindful. Clarify what's going on. Who is this court case? Child support. Who is this? Yeah, something about a child. Two of Pentacles. Whatever this is, it's been a while. It's like maybe something's going back and forth, back and forth with the Two of Pentacles. It's like maybe there's been one court case and then somebody's trying to do something. And maybe you didn't get what it was that you're supposed to get, but you're going to get this. Judgment's in your favor. It's in the upright. Yeah, justice and judgment's in your favor. Not just fifty, but in the three D as well. Clarify what's going on. Clarify what's going on. Somebody's trying to do something with some documentation too, so they can get out of giving something. Yeah. Six of Wands. You're gonna win again. I don't know what they're trying to stop, but I feel like that case is adjourned. So whatever somebody's trying to do, it's a no, and this is why they're in the Nine of Swords. Some type of group effort. Why is my left ear ringing? What's with the sexual connection? It's the king of swords. Somebody's in your energy. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. This person wants to come back. You can have a son with this person. Okay. Something's being illuminated. Yeah, you got a child with this person. King of swords. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. What's going on with this person's sexual connection? I just heard reconciliation. Yeah, you're standing your ground. You could be celibate. <laughs> This person's being blocked by the universe. Seven of Wands, okay? Somebody's being blocked by the universe, okay? That's your ancestors. Yeah, you like, uh-uh, uh-uh. Somebody wants to spend the block. This yeah, to reconcile Ace of Cups. Knight of Wands, child, they trying to get back into your sexual energy. Somebody could be doing sex magic with the Knight of Wands. What's going on? Are they doing sex magic on Pisces? What's up? Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, they want to... They're trying to get to your gifts. You got the Ten of Pentacles here. This is your ability to manifest your sexual energy, solar plex energy. Somebody is like... Like somebody knows that you're abundant. They know that you manifest well. And they want to get back into your sexual energy. Because something's not working anymore. It's like I see somebody that wanted to take your sexual energy, your gifts. Clarify that for me, please, and thank you. Yeah, hell no. Get your punk ass up out of here. Listen, get your punk ass down, man. Who is this, Pisces? Comment down below. Listen, I just heard, that's just my baby daddy. That's just my baby daddy. That's just my baby daddy. Look, three of swords, child. Somebody is pissed. Three of Swords, separation. They can't get back into your bed. Okay, Divine Feminine. Could be a Divine Masculine and a Feminine, but take it as it resonates. I'm getting, I just heard, that's just my baby daddy. Listen, no, you ain't going back. You're in this abundant energy. Look, you got the Ace of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles. Somebody wants to get somebody pregnant again. Spirit, what am I saying? Show me what I need to see. Ulterior Motive. Yeah, this person got a motive. You know it. You ain't got time. Ulterior motive. Five of Wands. Silent competition. Jealousy. Uh, you're glowing. You're healing. And somebody is like, somebody liked it better when, when they were on your mind. And now that you're kind of minding your own business, they like, somebody likes the chase. You know? Okay. You want what you can have. All right. Well, you're one of those people. Smells a little narky. Smells like a narcissist. Yeah, I can't make it up. You're manifesting. You ain't got time. Magician, you're a master manifester. You're calling in abundance. You are abundant. Listen, somebody want to get all up in that energy. Somebody wants to be all up in that energy. You're coming out as the empress. Somebody that is absolutely healed from a lot. This is what I always like to say. Commercial dog on break. Being the empress is not easy. You see people running around, oh, I'm the empress, I'm the empress, I'm, uh, I'm the empress. Like, no. This takes, this takes a lot of work in order to be all the queens. And somebody knows that you're very, very valuable. And they want you so bad. I just heard sexual frustration. So this person could be in a position where they're not able to perform with other people. Could be a masculine, could be a feminine. Empress energy, let me tell you something. Whatever they got going on, it ain't what you got going on. They ain't got a damn thing to do with you. Listen, Empress.
come through with the come through. You're loving on yourself. You're focused. Something's about to go in your favor. This is life changing by way of this amount of money. Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, listen, I just heard a storm is a brewing. Child, the wind is picking up outside. And it's about to rain. Somebody's ancestors are here. What do you want them to know? Yeah, they say close out this cycle and let this person go. This person ain't going to never change. But this is confirmation. You know this. I don't feel like I'm telling you anything. I feel like this is just clarification. This is really how you feel. The cycle's over. Whatever lesson that was with this king of swords, you extracted that. Somebody's birthday could be May 21st. Or they're on the cusp of Gemini and Taurus. Thank you, spirit. Who is it? Some of you could have been dealing with a Libra. Clarify Libra. In September, two of wands. Yeah, here you go, four of swords, Libra. This person's been thinking about you too. This is a lot of spin the block energy. You know, it's almost like energetically they can smell that you're glowing. They can smell that you're healed. Even if you have not been in communicate with these people, they can feel it. It's like, oh, Pisces, okay. Yeah, you're in this quiet, abundant energy. You're moving in silence like lasagna. Not to be confused with lasagna. Listen, two of wands, Aries energy, something about going to a distance or this person's at a distance. You could have just made a decision to walk away from this person. Yeah, your spirit team is saying continue to close out the cycle. You're in some good energy. Show me Pisces energy right now. Yeah, you don't give a damn. Five of Cups is in the reverse, child. Yeah, you're over it. Like, this is the second card that came out in the reverse. I'm just going to put it back in. I feel like initially, this was disappointing for you. And the reason I put this card back in is just to make sure that it's supposed to be in the reverse. Because this is the second time this card thing came out in the water sign reading. So either water signs overall energy, y'all just ain't got no folks to give. You see what I'm saying? Like, we don't give a damn. Like that type of an energy. <laughs> Commercial break. Pisces. Pisces. You don't give a damn. No to give you're over it why did I get country on that part you're over it <laughs> child y'all hear oh the sirens somebody's birthday could be May 24 somebody could be dealing with a Gemini okay I don't know it's 5 24 on the clock I feel like that's somebody's birthday, but just take it as it resonates, whatever it is. Child, it's a 911 situation. Somebody, was somebody doing magic, sex magic, love spells? That shit backfired because this is a lot of obsession. <sighs> king of Wands energy. <laughs> Clarify the King of Wands, please and thank you. High Priestess, no. You know, they were, but it backfired. You intuitively know you're coming out as yourself. Big March Pisces. Big old March Pisces energy, okay? We got Aquarius Pisces too. Clarify uh, February Pisces. Yeah. Spirit is saying to watch your money, okay? You could be recovering from some type of a loss. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse, okay? Or you're, you don't want to do something by yourself, Okay? Clarify this for February Pisces. What's going on? Yeah. This is going to take some work. Okay. Something about a good group effort, team, collaboration, working well with somebody to overcome some type of financial obstacle. That's going to work out for you. Okay. Um, big March Pisces, though, coming through with the fire and the water. Okay. I, I, I just feel like we didn't already made a decision. You could be traveling too with the two of wands or relocating. Maybe that's what that apartment lease agreement something is about. Just make sure you're mindful of that. You're going to have some money to do something because it's a lot of money coming through. This also represents gifts being handed down by your ancestors. Okay. Yeah. Listen, Ten of Pentacles, you didn't have enough heartbreak and heartache, but I feel like you're doing just fine. You really, you really, honestly, somebody put you in a position where you just don't give a damn. Like, they gave you no other choice. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you forced my hand for me not to give a damn no more. I'm trying to tell you. Clarify. Somebody going to learn today. Yeah. 
Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn could be significant. Somebody's birthday's in May. Mm -hmm. And somebody's birthday's in September. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Somebody could be a Virgo, Leo, August. Okay. Big Capricorns. You have a lot of people obsessed with you right now. Like trying to find out what you're doing. If you're really, really quiet, clarify. You could have recovered financially from something. Yeah, you were at a fork in the road. You had to make a real hard decision. Two of Swords, okay? Two of Swords is about do I go left, do I go right? You followed your intuition, but in order to do this, you had to get quiet. Somebody's quieting down the chaos, unplugging. You know, it's like I'm unplugging, I'm gone, but I'm not gone for good. Some of these situations, though, you killed them indefinitely. Unless you have some type of a responsibility with a child, this, whatever somebody got going on, it's a no. You're protecting your peace. And that Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles is a whole bunch of money. Something's coming in that you've been waiting for. Two of Swords is about making a decision, okay? Balance. That's giving me my odd energy. Clarify that for Pisces, current energy. Yeah, the star. Somebody's in the public eye, okay? This is big February energy. Could be March as well, okay? Yeah, something about star quality, but I'm getting Aquarius energy. You can have Aquarius anywhere in your chart, though. If you're a cross watcher, there's a cross watcher here trying to figure out what you got going on, child. They need to pick up the phone and call you. If you don't watch a reading to try to find out what Pisces got going on, then nine times out of ten, you couldn't be further from the truth. Whatever you think it is, you probably don't even know. And that's all I'm going to say about that. Confirmation. Listen, somebody's in the public eye. Clarify the star. Yeah, and somebody's watching you. Damn. Well, because I, I, I heard in my spirit, they're all watching. Everybody's watching. I'm like, what? You know, when my spirit guys talk to me, my shit be just clear. I'm like, what? <laughs> Whenever I get my downloads, sometimes I'm in the water, water signs. You know, I like to get my downloads in the bathtub. And when I get my downloads, I'll be like, what? <laughs> telling me all kind of stuff i'm like he did what and then i go flip the cards i'm like oh i gotta do a reading animal medium so sometimes people's ancestors be rolling up on me i'll be like what okay who, who needs this reading then i go to the platform and i flip the cards and somebody's like this is my exact story i'm like i know your ancestors kind of you know intervened on my my bath time okay and i channeled the energy <laughs> but child they all watching. Who is they and what do they want? Clarify, Page of Swords. Yes, yeah, the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Mm -hmm. Big Capricorn energy. You got a Capricorn watching you. Somebody has a Taurus, Gemini watching. Big Gemini energy coming out real strong, okay? And a Virgo. Child, they all watching. Who is this King of Pentacles watching Pisces in the public eye? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Somebody that cannot project some illusions onto you no more. Whatever they got going on. Somebody could have been projecting some type of illusion. Seven of Cups. Clarify that for Pisces. Who's watching? If you're not in the public eye, you're being called to come into the public eye. Yeah, I can't make this up. You could be somebody that's being called to do tarot. Queen of Cups is psychic, intuitive, star is platform, high priestess energy, child. People need you and your ancestors are calling you. Okay, they pushing me now. Okay. Whoever you are, you are supposed to be using your gifts in the public eye. If, if you are not already doing this, you will be. Clarify that Queen of Cups, public eye. Yeah, I cannot make this up. I cannot make this up. You got people sad, emotional, okay? For some of you, it's another water sign. <laughs> there could be a cancer that's really regretful. I just heard June. Listen. Okay, shout out to the first part of the reading being dedicated to cancer. Don't you just love the controversy? Is it a good cancer? Is it a bad cancer? But somebody's heavy in regret. Somebody's drinking a little bit too much too. Before a cup, somebody's going to see you in the public eye. Okay, something about being very, very successful and they feel as though it's a missed opportunity. I just heard woulda, coulda, shoulda, child, but you didn't. <laughs> okay, let's do Let's just call it the way it is now. Listen, yeah, somebody's thinking about the past. It could be a partnership, friendship. Somebody wants to come and invest, okay? Yeah, somebody's watching other people give to you. King of Pentacles, somebody wants to come in and make you some type of an offer. This could start out as a friendship, two of cups. 
to the Ten of Cups, child. Piscean energy. I cannot make this up. Whatever this is, it's a beautiful offer. Clarify this King of Pentacles, Two of Cups, and Ten of Cups. Who is this person? Yep, some type of communication is coming in. They're a little timid, though. They're a little scared. It's like this. Eight of Wands, like, should I send a message? Shouldn't I send a message? Okay, I want to... Okay, and, but it's like this, really. Eight of Wands is communication. Text message. Uh, maybe somebody's commenting on your video. Clarify Eight of Wands. Yeah, child. Somebody is watching you. They want you to see them. Could be a Virgo in August. Big Leo energy. Could be a Leo. Could be this King of Wands. But you're coming up as the King of Wands, too. Somebody's got a lot of fire and earth, okay? Yeah, and somebody is like hurt. Somebody's butt hurt that they missed out on an opportunity. But I feel like you're just focused on whatever this is. Focused on your craft is what I heard. Clarify for Pisces. Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. What's going on? Please and thank you. Yeah, child, this is about to be a nice situation. Mm, mm, mm. King of Cups to the Queen of Cups. Child, I told y'all these partnerships are coming in. Knight of Wands energy. Whoever this person is, Knight of Wands to the King of Cups, somebody's passionate. This is normally Knight of Wands gets a bad rap, like flighty. Nah, this is somebody that's coming in with passion. Somebody with a lot of momentum, okay? Because they're coming up as the King of Cups to your Queen of Cups energy and vice versa. Yeah. And for some of you, this is you, Divine Masculine. Okay, you could be going in to make an offer to somebody. March Pisces energy here too. Could be February as well. Mm -hmm. Something with a fire sign is going to be a real good connection. Could be a Sagittarius. Some type of communication is coming in. This is going to be beautiful though. This is a new beginning. This is not something from the past. This is you in a new beginning and not giving a damn about whatever somebody got going on. Big divine masculine energy. Emperor to the Empress. Can we have, listen... Can we just have a moment of beautiful silence for the emperor to the empress, high vibrational divine union, king to the queen of cups, ace of cups. I know I sound calm, but inside I'm really like, ah, Pisces. Like that's how I feel on the inside. But I have to channel the message, so I have to keep a certain decorum about me, you know, very demure, if you will. Okay, listen. <laughs> Yeah, what is going on? This is good. I just heard. Situation number nine. Blowing my mind. Somebody could be a life path number nine. <laughs> That's the way my spirit guides come through. Child in the water. Wait in the water. Somebody is way down, child. They've been waiting in the water for you, Pisces, child, and the wait is done. Somebody thought you was coming back. Oh, my spirit guy, tell me, you not coming back. No, no. <laughs> oh, como se dice no in English? No. Como se dice no in Spanish? No. You're not coming back, my friend. Ten of Wands, they're way down. Who is this person that's stressed out? They could be overindulging, smoking, drinking. Who is this? Isolated? Who is this in the Ten of Wands? Because somebody's watching you be successful. Yeah, they know that you're about to listen. Whoever this person is, they see you in a union. This fell right on top of the Ten of Cups. Some of these people are family members, okay? Not for all of you, but some of these people are watching your Ten of Cups. The king to the queen. These are two abundant people, two people that are very, uh, like, uh, they're in a lucrative business. They're following their passions. They work well together. They love together, and they work well together. Baby, this is your justice, okay? Who was in this Ten of Wands, though? Child, mm-mm. I don't know who this is. Eight of Swords, okay? Eight of Swords. What is that? Gemini energy? Ten of Wands? The Sagittarius energy? Let's just leave the Zodiacs out and let's just say that somebody's ass is up the creek without a box of Kleenex. Somebody is crying a river, honey. And I don't feel like you cared. I feel like you cried your last tear. I'm all cried out type of an energy. 
Eight of swords, child, they feel trapped and strapped and they're in their head. They're going through a dark night of the soul. Ten of wands, they weigh down and they're watching you in the public eye. Or they will be, or somehow they're getting some type of information. Some of you are about to move into a new place, okay? Yeah. Mm -mm. You coming up as yourself, hey man. You see things in a different perspective or this person is now seeing you in a different light. It's almost like fumbling a divine person, a king or a queen, and now you don't miss them until your well has run dry. Yeah, now you don't miss... Ooh, I just heard, now you don't miss what you never had? Is that you, Pisces? <laughs> yeah, I hear you saying, I can't miss what I never had. Like, you got tired of being patient with somebody. But you're seeing things from a different perspective. This is such Empress Emperor energy. I love it. I love it. You're saying, blame it on me. Say it's my fault. I'll take all the smoke. This is what I just heard. Blame it on me. I'll take it. Don't worry. It's okay. It's my fault. But get out of my way. I'm about to get up out of here, away from you, and get into this Eight of Cups energy. Yeah, the hangman. You're seeing things differently. You see yourself differently. And somebody knows that. I just heard it'll never be the same. Yeah, you don't care. You got something going on. I can't make this up. You're taking a leap of faith. You're taking a leap of faith, fool. The fool card, money's coming in, something's looking good. Whatever this child support and situation is, that's going to work out. There's more than enough money. You could be going into a union with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. This is a good union. There's a lot of love there. Could be a November Scorpio. Somebody could be with a November Scorpio. Okay, somebody's in their head. Somebody don't want to fight no more. I feel like you just, mm-mm, mm-mm. Anything else we need to speak for Pisces? Yeah, you broke free from the devil, child, bye. The devil in the reverse. Listen, whatever this was, it was toxic. Something about shadow work, codependency. I feel like you gave more than you got out of this situation. I do. Whatever it was, Spirit put you in the hangman position. The moment you started to get into that hangman position, you could see something from a different perspective. And this is you manifesting. That's actually how you manifested this ending. Yeah. Whoever you are, you're very obedient to source. You are a spiritual teacher. You are a spiritual leader. You could be in the public eye. You're doing something and people are watching and it's going to grow. This is what I'm hearing. And somebody's watching you that wants to come in. Somebody could be wanting to come in and make an offer, a proposal. I'm getting divine feminine energy. I'm also getting a Pisces that's in the public eye. Okay. Big March energy. Yeah, somebody is choosing wisely. Everything that they do. I feel like you want equal give and take more now than you've ever wanted this. I do. I really, really do. Yeah, I mean, I'm because I'm getting giving, like a giver. And it's like, you know what? No, I deserve to kind of be, you know, I, I deserve to be on the giving end of, you know, receiving, right? <laughs> somebody giving to me and I'm giving to them. Because somebody who's, whoever's in this nine of swords, ten of wands, child, bye. Mm -mm, mm -mm. And whoever Mr. Masturbate or Miss Masturbate is over here thinking about y'all sexual energy, uh -uh. It's just frustrating them. Somebody can't perform with somebody else. And I hate to put them out there like that. But I feel like your love is healing. Okay? Is what I heard. Sexual healing. It's more than just sex. Right? It's intimacy. You get to a level in your spiritual walk where you get it. You're like, no, this is more than just sex. It's, 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 it's an energy. And I can't just give that to everybody. Well, thank you, Pisces. 108444. I didn't know we were going to go this long. Scorpio, we're going to start you out at 10844. You are the last of the water sign readings. Why do I have to smack like that, Scorpio? Why? Because I feel like something's about to come out in your reading, Scorpio. Listen, Scorpio. Scorpio, gang, gang, gang. Scorpio.
Scorpio, gang, gang, gang. Why do I gotta get so, ugh, ugh. I always say why, but you know, I'm never gonna change that about myself. I'm so dramatic. Come on in here, Scorpio, gang, gang, gang. Beautiful Holy Spirit, beautiful divine ancestors. Ooh, somebody don't want something to come out. Okay, we, we start like that. Can I finish the prayer, Scorpio gang gang, for your ancestors and your spirit guides? Just start getting all up in my clear audience by way of mediumship and by way of me channeling. What's going on with the Scorpio gang 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 and beautiful spirit team, spirit guides, Archangel Michael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Raphael? Somebody could be invoking all their angels. I feel like whoever you are, you are a prayer warrior. Mm, you are not to be messed with. Somebody thinks that, somebody thinks that you are the devil. <laughs> Instead, you're on another level. I just heard Scorpio. Scorpio. I feel like Scorpio. You just don't give a damn. I mean, oh God. Yeah. What do they say? I B A F. I don't give a fudge cake. Yeah, these are lint lickers, man. <laughs> these are lint lickers. Who are these people? Holy Spirit, beautiful angel. What do we got for Scorpio? Current, current energy for Scorpio, please and thank you. What's going on? Oh my God, child. What is going on? Uh, 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 uh. Scorpio, did I not just say somebody thinks that you're the devil? Could you be an angel? Could you be the devil? You're so hypnotizing. That's what I'm hearing. You're from a whole nother world, a different dimension. Somebody thinks you are like, they don't know what you are. <laughs> Did I not just say, but the Satanist is in the reverse? Somebody could have told people that you were worshiping the devil? Yeah, I just heard that's how they're saying you got your power. The devil's in the reverse, though. You find this to be quite amusing. <laughs> Scorpio, what is going on? Somebody could be getting their passport, okay? What's going on, Scorpio? Say this in the reverse. Yeah, somebody somebody thinks you're the devil or they, like somebody could have thrown some spell work at you. Yes, yeah, five. Oh, excuse me, 544 on the clock. You could be saying 444 or 555. Clarify statements in the reverse or just uh, tell me what's going on with Scorpio. Okay, what else does Scorpio need to know? Please and thank you. Child, the cards are falling where they may. Police officer, law officer, highway patrol, sheriff. So be mindful. Somebody could have got a traffic violation. Okay, or you might have to go to court for a ticket. Or somebody could be a police officer. I don't know. A sheriff, warning, law official, something about travel, okay? So watch that. You might need to get your car checked or oil change or something like that. Somebody's starter. Be careful with your starter. Hey, y'all spirit guys is just like real specific. Like you couldn't say alternator. Like, you know what I mean? God forbid. We're not going to speak that onto Scorpio Sky. You know what I'm saying? But your spirit team is like, nah, it's the starter. Like whose spirit guide is this? <laughs> they like, no. Get it right. It's the starter. They need to check the starter. Listen. Okay, my nose is itching. Child, somebody got a neighborhood mechanic, you'll be fine, okay? And check your brakes, okay? The Holy Spirit, and, and your tags, okay? Something about somebody's tags. Somebody's ancestors are freaking hilarious. What else do we need to know about? Yeah, who is this person? You got little chaos agents, breaking up happy homes, chaos agent, yeah. Somebody is sending you like nasty energy. Okay, whatever, whatever, okay. Mm -hmm. Spirit is saying, we don't need this card. You already got the reading, okay? This is about your car, tags, insurance, getting pulled over. Just, just take care of the car, Scorpio. Whatever you got to do. Money is coming, okay? This is what I heard. But breaking up happy homes, child, Satanist in the reverse, I feel, is the main focus of your reading. Oh. I just heard somebody say, I'm so tired of these raggedy ass people. <laughs> that just, <laughs> I just said, somebody say, Scorpio worships the 
devo. But it's in the reverse. So somebody's finding out that what somebody is saying about you is a lie. What the hell is Scorpio? Ah. So I got to blow on these cards with Scorpio. Tell us what's going on. Breaking up happy homes. Chaos agent. Somebody's sending you some type of conflict. Child, you a whole divine being. Look at this here. Ace of Cups. You got a new beginning. New love. New money. New you. The new love is really just you being in a relationship with yourself. But somebody's coming in to match your fly. Match your divinity. Match your work ethics. Like, it's a match. Child, somebody said you was a whole devil. Clarify statements in the reverse. Or did you just turn the devil's ass upside down? What's going on? Child, I don't know what they got going on. But somebody don't want you to get to this union. But it's happening. Four of Wands, you got a divine union coming in. Somebody wants to break up your happy home before you get to the happy home or, or even you might already be with this person. Somebody wants to stop if they know that it's coming. Y'all hear the sirens? Why did they even try, Scorpio? Why would they even bother? The devil's on that ass. They want to play with the devil? They thought you was the devil? I can't make it up. Five of Swords. Five of Swords is feeling defeated. Somebody was trying to send you chaos energy or wreak your wreak havoc on your home or send you some type of nasty ass energy. Child, that shit bounced off. Mm -mm. They out there playing with the devil now. They done made up some type of lie. Clarify what's going on. Five of swords here. Three of cups. Child, you over here celebrating. And being celebrated. Something's getting you some type of recognition. Or this is a wedding. Yeah, three of cups and the four of wands. You already know it though. You're coming up as yourself at the bottom of the deck. Caring, loving, kind. These are people that tried to put you in the bottom, see you down and out. Somebody wanted to see you down and out, energetically. Somebody wanted to humiliate you. Yeah, these are people that you could have left out in the past or left behind. Okay, so now they're bitter bonnies and bobbies and bobettes and like, what they got going on? Child, you moved on. The chariot, you ain't got time. Something about your car though, so please be mindful of that. Clarify what's going on with the five of swords and the Satan's in the reverse. Child, the devil feels defeated. Yeah, somebody was sending you nasty energy to your house. Okay? Breaking up happy homes, chaos agent, home wrecker. You could just be too happy nowadays. Somebody wanted to see you down and out in a nasty energy. Eight of Wands is like a fast-moving energy. Somebody's throwing a rock and hiding their hand is what they're doing. Yeah. What is this? Okay, eight of swords. Like, somebody's a weirdo. You and this king of cups energy. Like, what's good? Clarify eight of wands. Communication. Yeah. Somebody, what the hell? Listen, somebody was sending some type of chaos energy. Somebody is the devil saying that you were the devil or trying to make you feel, or not even make you feel. They wanted to make you feel their wrath is what I heard. Child, can we have a commercial break? Why would you even try with a Scorpio? This has got to be a suicide mission. Holy Spirit, Father God, let's just have a prayer. Whose bum-ass energy is this? Solid competition. Somebody is a hater. Father God, child, they're so concerned about you coming into this new home, new something, new, new, new everything. Somebody was sending you, yeah, they could have been sending you death spells. Child. Somebody called on death and the scorpionic energy showed up like, yes, this is death. Like, bitch, how you gonna call death on I can, can I make it up? Queen of Cups, you're over here unbothered. I just heard out of the way, minding your business. Child, child somebody did poverty spells. I cannot. You left these people out in the cold, though. You're minding your business. Eight of Pentacles, something that you do for work. Somebody could have wanted you to get fired. Somebody wanted you to be in distress. Child, forget them. What's the good news about Scorpio? I ain't got time. I feel like it's good, good. Bye. This is you. You're happy. <laughs> but I don't even give a damn about the devil. I don't even want to read the energy. The sun. Yeah, you're happy. You could have left, traveled, relocated, left these old weird-ass people out in the cold looking crazy with their old weird-ass banana fan, a full fan, a fee fi full fan, a okay. <laughs> Devil, bevel, bo bevel, banana fan, a full bevel, fee fi full fan, a devil. Listen, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, you're coming up as independent. 
Queen of Pentacles is a wife. Somebody could be wanting to apologize though. Who is that? The, yeah. Somebody wants to come in and give you some type of an offer. This could be a friend. Could be Capricorn. Or this is you. Clarify Queen of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles for Scorpio Spirit. Tempest Energy. Somebody's birthday is in December. No, this is you. This is all you. Spirit says, if you don't read the Zodiacs, you're coming up as abundant. Something that you do for work is paying off. It's like Knight of Pentacles is like reaping the benefits of your labor. Temperance. You're a temperance angel. Somebody said you was a devil. Now the devil was flipped upside down on his ass. You know I can't let the devil get off like that. Like, you a weirdo. Anyway, clarify what's going on for Scorpio. Yeah, somebody was doing moon magic. Possibly around the new moon, full moon, middle of the moon, middle of the night, looking crazy. And you over here doing all right. Somebody was sending chaos to your house. Yeah, to keep you confused. Could have been a Libra, child, we don't know, to a sword. Somebody wanted to create some type of confusion, indecisiveness, so that you couldn't see your ace of cups, so you couldn't see your partner, your twin, your soulmate. Yeah, and five of pentacles. Somebody wanted to send something to your house. I just heard to drain you of your energy so that you couldn't prosper. Five of pentacles. Show me these people since they want to come up. Who are these people? Yeah, illusions. This is projecting. This is witchcraft, magic. Only on a Scorpio reading do we get witchcraft and the devil upside down, child. The devil is standing on his head looking at, whoa, what happened? No, your ass happened. Out here lying on Scorpio. Clarify these old illusions. What do we need to know? I feel like you're winning. Yeah, it's a queen of swords. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Big Gemini energy, but this is really about your destiny. Clarify these people. What is it that they want? They wanted your destiny. Somebody wanted a destiny swap. Mm -hmm. They could have collaborated with somebody else. Virgo might be significant. This is like a group, a little coven. Child, who the hell are these people? King of Wands might be significant. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Big Leo, Virgo, Virgo, Leo energy. Who's the person breaking up happy homes? Chaos, Adrian, home record. Yeah. You know this already. Scorpio, we really don't need to go no further. This is what Spirit is saying. Spirit is like, Scorpio already know. Child, Scorpio don't give a damn. Show me Scorpio somewhere not giving a damn. Yeah, look. This is you. Five of Cups is your energy. It's endings. Initially, this could have really bothered you. But child, once you got over it, mm, show me Scorpio. Once you got over it, it's a wrap. The world. Four sources, meditation, minding your own damn business. You thought this through. You thought about it from every single angle. You like these mother, And you didn't say nothing about it. The fact of the matter is you didn't let these people see you sweat. Even if this bothered you, five of cups, you kept going. You know how I know? Because you got the ace of cups here. You're stable. The only way you can get that ace of cups is if you're focused. And you definitely can't get a devil no glory, period. Six of swords, you could have healed from something. Mm -hmm. These people wanted you sick, tired. Somebody wanted your power. To a wand, you made a decision to not give a damn no more. Okay. You woke up and was like, okay, do I want to give a damn about this? Nah, I'm good. Five, five, five. You got money coming in. That's Oshun's money. That's Oshun's number. Clarify. Yeah, I can't make this up. You already know what it is. Queen of Cups. You're loving on self, going within. You had to control that Scorpio stinger. You really want to knock these motherfuckers. But you said, you know what? Why? I'm just not going to do it. That's just not my problem. That's just, listen, you Queen of Cups energy, I love you so much, Queen of Cups. How you doing, boo? Listen, yeah, listen, Knight of Cups energy. There's somebody that looks really, really good for their age. <clears throat> you got the Queen of Pentacles to the Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Cups to the Knight of Cups, okay? And somebody wants to come in and give you an offer. What is this beautiful energy? Yeah, somebody wants to take a leap of faith with you. And somebody knows that you have this coming in. Whoever these people are, this group, could be a queen of swords and a king of wands. Yeah, it's like they know you got this coming in. They wanted to stop you. Look, I can't make this up. The devil. Somebody could have called on the devil himself. They wanted you in an imbalance. Big Capricorn energy. Could be a Capricorn significant or somebody has it. Highly aspected in their chart. They wanted to win at all costs. Somebody was really, really trying real, 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 real hard. Like real hard. And you still got your, you still got your will of fortune. Somebody wanted your destiny. Who is it? Mr. Mrs. Destiny Block. Swap. 
swapping out energy, chaos energy, wanting to send chaos to your house, make you exhausted or something like that. If you work from home, somebody wanted you to be like to where you couldn't uh, get to your money or something like that. This was to slow you down and it just did not work. And these people are mad. I just heard, how you gonna be the, the pot calling the kettle black? Child, somebody was the devil calling you the devil. Whew, meanwhile, you got love coming in, honey, and it's beautiful. Somebody knows it, somebody's jealous. And the Ten of Cups. Some of these people are in your family, though. <clears throat> Excuse me, something about the throat chakra. Somebody don't want this to come out. Maybe it's the devil, child. Yeah, whoever this King of Swords in the reverse is, they need to sit their punk ass down. Could be an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Who's this King of Swords, Holy Spirit? This could be somebody in your family. Yeah, somebody did magic. Could be a Gemini. Clarify this person. What do they want? What is their deal? Yeah, somebody at a distance. Somebody you left a, a long time ago and left. Bye. Yeah, you're out of the way. You're minding your own business, naive. You're minding your own Scorpio business. And the fact that you controlled your stinger when you could have put these bitches six feet under, all you had to do was snap your fingers. Child spirit said they're going to go six feet under anyway for planting your energy. Lord have mercy. Ooh, your spirit team said, let's have a moment of silence for the resting in silence. They're going to be silenced in the grave. Somebody's going to be in judgment in this life and the next lifetime. It's like, damn. What did these people do? They tried to stop your destiny. There's a union for you. There's two butterflies that's like flying like this outside my window. Two people are meant to be together. Yeah, these people are heavy in regret. Whoever these people are, I just heard their karma's catching up to them. This is something that somebody was doing over and over and over and over and over. This could have been death spell, sickness spell, poverty spell, something, and it's just not working. I just heard you're way too powerful for that. Yeah, and they're watching you. Page of Swords, they could be getting some type of divination. They're trying to stay a, a step ahead of you to block you. Yeah. Child, these people better walk away. Eight of Cups. These are people you left behind, honey. Somebody's watching. Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius could be significant. Justice, a Libra. Child, who are these people? They're watching your partnership. Something about your divine partnership that's going to be very prosperous. Yeah, look, Six of Pentacles. Somebody's coming in to give you equal give and take. This is like good energy. Like you don't have to look over your shoulder. Like this is some good energy. Child, show us the other person. Who is the other person? Somebody that you share a past life with. This is not reconciliation. I don't see you going back to nobody from your past. Somebody could be going back to a Pisces though. That might be a good connection. Yeah, I don't know what this is, but something about your love, something that you do for work, eight of pentacles, judgment, child, I cannot make it up, and the lovers. Whoever this person is coming in, you've shared many, 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 many lifetimes with this person. This person is remembering who you are, and you're remembering who they are, or you will remember. They're coming in, Scorpio. I feel like some of you is like, okay, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, okay, whatever. Like, you really in this self-love energy, manifesting energy, good love energy. Like, this is good business. While the devil is over here standing on his head trying to figure out how the hell this is not hitting you. Yeah, look, and they still trying. Child, these people are dumb. I just heard they're planning something for the next four months. Seven of Swords. This shit is going to flop so bad. Mm -mm -mm. You're coming up as the empress. You're caring, you're loving, you're kind, you're gentle. The beautiful divine feminine energy. You're all the queens. People are looking at you. They love you. Yeah, your wishes are coming in. Spirit is like, ignore them. Something about keeping your stinger intact. Because you already know that segment stinger, scorpion energy. All you got to do is get a little bitty prick right on their ankle. On that Achilles heel. Child, a whole coven on drop. You're not even giving them any energy. I'm so proud of you, Scorpio. You are the rising phoenix. You have risen to your highest potential because you very well could look at them and just think the thought and you know, death would come upon them and they would drop. <laughs>
<laughs> like a permanent dirt nap type of an energy. But you're so focused. They don't know. They didn't know who you were, Scorpio. Yeah, they watch it, child. Page of Swords, somebody is watching. Who are these people? If you have a social media presence, child, they are watching. Show us these rack of around for a moment. What's going to happen, spirit? Yeah, they're going to be heartbroken, looking stupid and crazy. Look at this here. Look at this here. Look at this here. Somebody's planning something around the full moon with the seven of swords. They're still sneaking and deceptive, cooking up something in hell's kitchen, the devil's kitchen. They're trying to get people to see that you worship the devil. You don't worship the devil. The first card that came out was divine intervention, and the sun just came out outside. That is confirmation. Spirit does not play about you, score B O gang, 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 gang. You're coming out as the Ace of Cups. Yeah, somebody directly connected to swords. These people are about to be so disappointed like they've been over and over. This is a form of insanity, child. They are so invested in you and what you got going on. You could be seeing flies, monitoring spirits, a little something, whatever. Ignore it. Keep going. You got some good energy coming in here. And you got the Ten of Pentacles that's coming. Yeah, Spirit is saying, hold your peace. Hold your stinger. Hold your venom. They can't take it, child. They like, somebody really in this covenant is saying, could you be the angel or could you be the angel or God or are you the devil? These people don't know what the hell you are because whatever they've thrown at you, you've overcome it. And they're stuck. They don't know what to think. They're going crazy. Yeah, look. And you still got this. Ace of Pentacles. This has got to be divine intervention. If these people don't know nothing about nothing at no other time other than the one that we're in right now, one thing that they know, that one thing is for sure. You are not to be touched and two things are for certain. You are blessed. This Ace of Pentacles is some type of unexpected income. Somebody's coming in to love you right. You still got somebody from the past that's trying to wiggle their way back in. They could be struggling, tired, and just doing more magic child, wasting all their resources. Let them. This was always to get you to a place of being untouched. You are an ascended master. Child, come through with the comfort. I know I got time for the bullshit. Ten of Cups. Happiness, joy, fulfillment. I just heard the family that you walked away from, God is giving you a new family. This could be soul tribe family or something with your new lover, your new people, your soul tribe, people that resonate with your soul. <coughs> Clarify the Ten of Cups, please. And thank you, Holy Spirit. You could be seeing 10, 10. Ten of Cups and Ten of Pentacles. Clarify, Spirit. What's going on? I can't make it up. It's in divine order. Look. And you went through a major transformation. That lion's gate took you on a little whirlwind, Scorpio. You died several times. You sure the hell did. You showed them how to do it. You said, let me show you how to die. You want to send me death spells? Let me show you how to die. You want to send me death? Let me show you how to die. Let me show you how to die. That's going to be on my next <laughs> self-proclaimed album. Let me show you how to die. I'm going to do it again. Let me show you how to die. I'm going to do it again. Let's Listen, okay, so you got the nine of cups to the ten of cups, something's in divine order. And of course, you got death at the bottom of the deck. You're coming out as yourself because you've gone through a major transformation. I feel like the lion's gate, retrograde, all of that good news about money coming in. Something's coming in real good. Whatever it is, it worked in your favor. It worked to your advantage. And somebody's ass don't know what to do. You're getting some news, some good news about some money. Something about a child, too. Somebody could be pregnant around here. Who's pregnant, Scorpio? You might have already met your person. Ooh, it's a tower, child. It's a tower, tower, wonder-working tower. In the precious name of the Scorpio gang, gang, gang. You bringing about towers, okay? There's a tower here. Clarify the tower. I feel like this is a good tower, though. Because I feel like it's getting rid of some bullshit. Something is something. Somebody wants to crumble your fountain child by. Okay. Well, I don't know. Hey, how you doing, Scorpio? It's me. Listen. You put a divine masculine coming up in here. Divine feminine. King of Cups. The Emperor. Who does not play about you. 
and nobody else. Whoever this is, this person is a protector. They are a lover and they will fight for you however they need to. This person is very calm, very grounded. Listen, King of Cups, this person loves themselves. If they're not a water sign or a fire sign, baby, they are in the King of Cups, Emperor Energy. But you and I know that the Emperor is all. The King's child could be a King of Pentacles, King of Cups, King of, King of Swords, King of King of King of King of Kings, okay? And this tower, it's like this is what's going to happen to your enemies when they get wind that you're still in this Wheel of Fortune energy, still in this Ace of Pentacles energy, still in this judgment in the upright. The universe is saying all because you controlled your stinger. These people were trying to provoke you. They wanted you irritated. They wanted to prove that you were some type of devil. And the thing about it is, Scorpio, you know how, listen, you know how to get in your shadows. You're like, look, leave me alone, please. Please, just please, baby, baby, please. Go play with the devil. Go play on the freeway. Do what it is you feel you need to do. But this ain't what you want. The tower. So something about your new love, new money, possibly a new baby is about to be a tower for somebody, child. Mm, somebody could be passing away and leaving you some money. A Leo. Mm, spirit is saying, be strong. This could be somebody in your family. That's not for everybody. That's just an immediate. Yeah, these people wanted your power. Mm -hmm. Page of Cups. You got people that want to apologize in your family. Some, I don't know who this is. Yeah, somebody's way down. Somebody in your family that might be passing away or just people that you left behind that you put endings to. I'm getting yes, yes, and yes for all of that. All of the above. Yeah, because you walked away. You walked away from these people. Good for you. And I feel like you're in a good space. Yeah, Queen of Wands might be significant. Somebody's got a sister or a, a something here. Somebody could be a Leo. A March Pisces or Aries in the family. They're way down. Because there's some type of ending coming. And it's like somebody could be leaving you something. The star. You could be in the public eye. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Thank you, spirit. Somebody's a November Scorpio. This is really specific to your, uh, your life. Okay, Spirit is saying something is coming. This is for somebody just specific. Somebody's in November Scorpio. Something about a child. A Leo could be significant. Or you have Leo Holly aspect in your chart. You could be in the public eye. But the Ten of Wands. Why is that Ten of Wands there? Yeah. Okay. <sighs> yeah, somebody is just messing with you. Somebody's a dark practitioner. The Hierophant in the reverse. This is for somebody specific. Somebody could be in the public eye. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. That's like coming for you. Yeah. Somebody's a Leo, Virgo, Virgo, Leo. Wherever this person is, if you're in the public eye, they absolutely are a dark practitioner. And they're doing some type of spell work over you. But you're aware of it. Okay, they want a tower for you. Yeah, they want you in your head and they're doing a lot of projecting. So it's this person. It's somebody in the public eye. If you're in the public eye, it's somebody else in the public eye. Okay? Yeah, they want you stressed out, but I feel like they're stressed out. Yeah, this didn't work. Hangman in the reverse. This shit didn't work. This shit backfired. Bye. Get up out of here with that. Because I feel like you're just minding your business. Anything else for Scorpio? Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Anything else? I think that's it. Scorpio, this could conclude your reading. Yeah, shit. What a good way to end a doggone reading, child. And Spirit says, what I'm saying is the truth. Ace of Swords, child, listen. Scorpio, first of all, look, I'm acting like we just started the reading. <laughs> first of all, Scorpio, listen. Yeah, somebody in the public eye is doing magic over somebody. You could be in the public eye and they could be in the public eye because of that star. Or there's somebody in the public eye that's a dark practitioner. Could be a Taurus or could be a Virgo. 
I'm getting Virgo, August, Virgo, Leo, something like that. They're doing magic. They want a tower for you, okay? Somebody wants a tower for you. But I feel like you're just minding your business and it's not working. Whoever this is, I'm talking to somebody real specific, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is for somebody specific. But overall energy for Scorpio, ignore these hoes, okay? They pressed. These bitches is pressed and ironed out, laid out, falling into ditches, trial, trying to, why do I want to say trial? Like a trial error? Somebody got a, 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 a free trial to try you and now their trial time is up, their free trial is up because the devil's on that ass. <laughs> You're just saying. And the fact that you didn't pull out your stinker. Watch your thoughts, Scorpio, because you know you could just think it and it'll happen. Okay, please be mindful. Pisces, Cancer, too. Like, listen, let's just stay in this high vibration. They want to drag you back to the shadows. Somebody said you was a devil worshiper, though. Something about your good news coming in. So somebody wanted to tarnish your image. They could have been talking about you, child. Don't like give a damn. The Most High said, I'm going to sew these people's mouths shut, lips to their asses. They want to kiss ass and run their mouth so much. With your ass talking ass. With your ass on your face ass. With your ass on your face ass. Fast, fast, fast. Something's coming in fast with the eight of wands. Listen, you old face ass. Goat mouth fast. Ragged them out with a ragged them out. Yeah, hold your venom. Hold your venom, Scorpio. They're raggedy. They're raggedy. Ragamuffins. I might do a reading on ragamuffins and scallywags. <laughs> in honor of Scorpio. <laughs> Scorpio, drop a little stinger down below for the scorpion and a heart like love with, with venom. Listen, I love you, but I'll give you a little bit of this venom. <laughs> I love you, Scorpio. I love you, water sign. Oh, God, I damn near choked. I love y'all so very much. Thank you so much for just hanging in there. I'm going to timestamp all of this for the people that don't want to get through the live. You can just go back to your part in the reading and watch the video from there. But I love you so very much. I will see you in the next video. Water sign, gang, gang, gang. Until then, peace be with you.